So I got some milk ready because I'm going to be doing a review of the Big Lots exclusive 7-pack flavors of the Sound Alarm Hot Sauce Collection. I'm not too sure if I'm... Yeah, this is Josh's Snack and Candy Reviews. I'm pretty sure I'm going to title that as... i got to check on the other sauce reviews to see what I... I think it's Josh's Snack and Candy Reviews. I don't know. But anyway, let's try this. Take my catalogs that I have on my window window sill. Take them down. Oh, all right. This is probably going to be painful. I'm expecting that's how it's going to be. So uh, this is for a video. I just have to say this is for a video. But this is Big Loss exclusive, which Big Loss or Big Loss doesn't make a lot of. Exclusive products really. I mean they make a few every once in a while, but this is something major that Big Lots made Because uh, this is hot sauce I am gonna keep this packaging too, so I'm gonna uh, Attempt to not destroy it because I want to keep the uh, Fire truck Got this last week at Big Lots. Of course I did. Before I got my tattoo. And these are all the hot sauce. I guess I'm gonna have to because it doesn't come out. Oh well. These are actually small little bottles. They're actually not the big bottles like I thought they were going to be. But So let's try the the Ignite Salsa Verde hot sauce right here. It's kind of like what Taco Bell used to have. And we're going to put a little bit on the spoon right here. Very mild, not very hot. Very low. It's pretty good, actually. Next up is going to be the Firehouse Hot Sauce. Not too sure how hot this is, but... Smells potent. Smells really potent, actually. Oh, no. <laughs> wow.
All right, I already see ghost pepper sauce in here, and I know for a fact that's going to be really hot, so I'm not going to eat as much as that. This one oh, smells hot, too. This is the Bomber, Bomber Rio Mexican style hot sauce. Kind of tastes like Taco Bell's fire sauce. Or maybe like their hot sauce, the hot sauce one. Backdraft hot sauce. It also smells potent. Not bad. Not bad. I don't have to have milk with that one. This one's the only one that's actually pretty hot. Ranging Inferno. This habanero. Three left. Four down, three left to go. Some of these freaking... Uh, caps are like really hard to... Take off. Well, I am doing this video for you, and for you, and for you. For everybody on YouTube right here, on my YouTube channel. Whew. That's got a kick to it. Mm -hmm. As you can see, my <laughs> face... <clears throat> Is starting to get red because of the heat of the hot sauce. This one's gonna hurt. Actually, I don't know. I don't know which if this is ghost pepper. This says smoke eater, smoky bourbon pepper sauce. Doesn't really specifically say which. Peppers are used in this. It's probably like habanero and other peppers. I, I'm not really too sure. And I'm going to do another video of these for TikTok. Because why not? Put myself in more pain. Most of these hot sauces aren't actually that hot. Um, I think this is, yeah, this is habanero. This last one is called Blaze Garlic Sauce, which looks like it's going to be hot because it's got a person with uh, flames coming out of their mouth. Not bad. No, I, I'm actually sweating, but I think it's because it's hot in here. It's probably because the um, my humidifier is like right here, like right here. The humidifier is right under me, so um, it's probably that's the reason. But to be honest, these hot sauces aren't really actually hot, but 
They are spicy. I wouldn't say they're to a point where I would probably scream in pain. But I wouldn't say they're mild by any way. They're not mild. I probably want to eat these on a daily basis. But nothing milk can't handle to go with. I know that sounds like a sissy, but... Sometimes if I have too much hot sauce and too much hot sauce in my stomach, it hurts. So, to be on the cautious side, that's why I got some milk here. And my lip's on fire. I just felt my lip. It's on fire. That's the only thing that happened to me. It's the, my lip's on fire. That's it. Anyway. So, on a scale of rating of 1 to 10, I'd probably give these a 9. They're actually pretty good. They're hot. Some of them are hot. Um, this one's not too hot. And this one's not really too hot either. But the rest of them are probably in between of like... I don't know. The fire hot sauce at Taco Bell or like the Basco hot sauce. They're like in between of that. Most of them are like the Diablo hot sauce at Taco Bell. Where that's like the scale rating of what they are. Well, not scale rating, but the rating of how hot they are. Spiciness. But they're not ghost pepper in any way. So, anyway. My, t my lip right here is on fire. That's the only thing that's happening right now. My lip is on fire. Oh. That's it. My tongue, my mouth is not on fire, but my lip right here is on fire. Oh. Anyway, thanks for watching.